Luke 5, a man finds Jesus alone in the village and asks him that if he is willing to heal him of his leprosy. Jesus responded that he was willing and he reached out his hand and completely healed him. Then Jesus asked him something a little strange. He asked him not to tell anyone that it was he that did it. Now we know in this and other accounts that the man did go out and tell people, which begs the question, why did Jesus give him this instruction if he knew he would be disobedient? Was Jesus setting him up for failure or tempting him to sin? No, James 1.13 is very clear that God does not tempt us. The answer is pretty straightforward. Jesus told him not to say anything because he didn't want him to say anything. As we read on, we see that because the leper talked, it greatly complicated the ministry Jesus was doing in that area. The crowd became so wanting and relentless that he had to escape to the wilderness several times. But a better question is this, why did Jesus heal him in the first place if he knew the man would be disobedient? And my answer to that question is that it's just who Jesus is. See, we are that leper. We were unclean in sin, and he was willing to heal us, even knowing we would fail him over and over. Our sin inconvenienced him all the way to the cross, but he still did it. This reminds me of what Paul told Timothy in 2 Timothy 2.13. If we are unfaithful, he remains faithful, for he cannot deny who he is.